Scotty. No, 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 no. It's ASMR, Scotty. There we go. And today, we are going to be doing controller tapping, scratching, and whatever else I can do, but not just with one controller. Oh, no, 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 no. No. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven controllers that we're going to be tapping on. And this is over generations of well, several generations, let's just put it that way. So buckle up, get your favorite snuggy, if those are still a thing. Get your teddy bear and get ready for some relaxation with controller sounds. Now, without further ado, let's get into it. Now, first, we have the PS5 controller. The PS5, the PS5, the PS5. And as you can see, I've got the super cool hot pink one. I've got a few actually. This one in particular is hooked up to my PlayStation 3 most of the time. Because most of my PS3 controllers aren't what they used to be. They work, but compared to a PS5 controller, and I mean the feel of these things. The feel of them, the feel. Them, the feel, the feel, the feel, the feel, the feel is just built completely and incredibly different. And uh, if you're wondering what game I play, it's Warzone. Be playing with a PS4 
PS4 controller back in its heyday. Probably Rainbow Six Siege was one of my most played games on multiplayer. When it comes to PS5 so far, it's just a super large mixture. I actually stopped playing multiplayer games for a little bit, and I haven't really picked it back up. I feel like there's just too much commitment to tell my friends I'm going to be online. And then I have to, I end up staying on for hours. And then I don't get to make videos. I will say, when it comes to PS4, the original, the 28. Teen Spider-Man game comes to mind, and Jedi Fallen Order comes to mind. I played both of those games at launch, and absolutely loved them. I have 100%ed, platinumed, in PlayStation's case, Jedi Fallen Order on the PS5. I thought about cleaning it up on the PS4 edition. I would just have to do a bunch of like miscellaneous tasks.
what I'm playing right now. Let's say it's Twisted Metal. A little bit of a throwback there. I've heard stories that they're coming out with a new PS5 one. Unfortunately, this is one of the finicky PS3 controllers that needs to be plugged in while I use it. I don't think it holds a charge anymore. But gosh darn it, it did its job for a very long time. It's allowed to retire.
because this is so loud, we are going to take a little less time with it and move on to what you can see it, the PS1 controller, the first controller of the video that does not have analog sticks. This is true ASMR in a controller. Unless I let go of the button that my finger grips. Let's see. There is literally no sound from the D-pad over here. L1 and R1 have good sound, so... to this side is like a louder PS. 
PS1. Almost like a looser PS2 with the buttons. But, let's move on to the final console that I have controllers for, minus the Switch. If you guys want to see the Switch, let me know and I will do it. However, for the time being, we've got the Legend of Zelda special controller. I was never a fan of the Switch controllers, especially disconnecting them. Unless if it's for something like uh, Nintendo Switch Sports. <sighs> I was so excited for that game. I was so excited for that game. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate came out, I made sure to get a controller like this because I was just getting stomped without this, with just the base controllers, because I've never had a controller like that other than maybe the Wii Remote, but that's the closest thing. Most of the time with this you can either find me playing Animal Crossing or Pokemon games. I'm not even going to name a specific one. And yes, I do have Scarlet and Violet. I haven't gotten around to playing them yet, but even though the graphics are kind of a down quality, I don't want that to keep like happening. But I don't hate the fact that of its like simplistic nature.
this controller. I'm not sure why I want to do this, but I just got the sudden urge. With the uh, GameCube controller. Yes, it's wireless. And yes, this is a pointer. Let's see. Cat, mad cats. Let's see. 2.4 gigahertz. 2.4. SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom on this system easily. There was also a fun game called Second Sight.